of glass and falls put some syrup on that so right now we're back with another video and today i'm gonna be showing you guys how to build a bottle cap rocket so basically all you're gonna need is a pencil it doesn't matter what kind of pencil it can be like one of the ones with the, like, the little um characters on it it can be uh it can be the the little, the little two or whatever you want it doesn't matter it, it just any pencil that you have any pencil with an eraser actually any pencil with an eraser that's what you guys need then an empty water bottle no water in there a couple drops as you can see but that's fine and a simple little bottle cap that goes on the top so now what you're gonna do is you're gonna grab your water bottle and you're going to twist see like this little part in between here that's kind of like an inlet you're gonna twist it on there so you're gonna grab this and then you're just gonna oh wait no no guys you see so you're gonna crumple here so you're gonna start like this you're gonna crumple it a little bit like that so there's a little bit of air missing now you're gonna screw the cap on and then you'll twist it right you'll twist the bottom of it just like this until there's a ton now there's a ton of air pressure in here right so there's tons of it now you're gonna unscrew your cap a pretty good amount uh, not that far and then you're gonna use your eraser and simply kind of like run your eraser on the groove so you basically be going like this you're just gonna run it on the groove fast so kind of like a, you're lighting a match put it on there and then you simply just like go down quick so to do this i'm gonna stand i'm gonna sit back here i'm gonna fire at the camera i don't know if you guys can see my dog he's in the background i think yeah he's here he's right behind the chair there you see him there he is uh, I, I so uh, also before I do this, one of my teachers actually requested me to chug um, something out of the bowl. So I think I'll be doing that later today, maybe. But yeah, guys. So now that you got all your air pressure here and you've unscrewed a couple of it, simply push it out and okay. Might take a couple tries. As you can see there, it fired pretty hard. The cap went all the way over here. So I don't know if that was a great shot, guys. But as you can see, it works pretty well. I don't know what it really looked like. Here, I'll do it again, I guess. So then you're kind of left with this, right? You got this weird warp bottle. You can... Okay, so you're left with this weird warp bottle. You can use this again. Simply untwist it till it looks like this. Then, and then you have a pretty good bottle again. Crumple it a little bit, just like that much so it looks like that. You screw the cap all the way on, guys. Not insanely tight, just, just to where it's tight, obviously. And then you have a little bit of air left in here. Twist it again. And as much as you want, you can twist this. And then sometimes if you want more pressure, you can actually squeeze down on it like that from the top kind of. And then you unscrew your cap until you're in. Yeah, oh, they're letting out a little bit of air there. So we're gonna twist it a little more now. Like that. Now we'll unscrew. Oh, we're letting out air. Dang it, I'm not doing this. Okay. It, it takes a little bit getting used to, you know. Okay, unscrew it to there. Now we got tons of pressure in here, and we can simply pop again, pop again, pop again, and just as simple as that, guys. It's as simple as that. Thank you guys for watching this video. Hopefully, this this will make it kind of fun to prank your siblings or your parents or something. You can shoot at them because. It's not gonna hurt you or like anyone. It's just a little bottle cap. Don't, but don't aim at the face because that, that would actually hurt you. And don't, yeah, just don't aim at the face. As long as you aim low like this, then you're okay. Just aim it low. Make sure you don't hit anything above, I'd say, your chest because otherwise that could get a little nasty. So that get a little, you know, the ow, ow, very much. But yeah, the only reason why I'm not just flicking up my finger is because I tried that and it's not completely like, Utter, like it's not completely like hurtless like it was kind of like ow you know it's kind of like oh god because it like kind of you kind of flick it but then it kind of taps your finger as it goes away so it like it doesn't even sting it like half stings for like half a second but you can completely do this just, i'm not recommending it so you can do this too the reason why i peeled the label off is because i don't want to get covered we'll do it one more time guys for good measure yes sir so go ahead unscrew the cap again you have this warp bottle you just untwist it till it looks like this so it's untwisted Blow it up again until it looks decently like this. Now, squeeze a little bit, screw the cap all the way on, twist the bottom. This is how fast you can do it. Twist the bottom. Um, if you want to, you can put your fingers on it and squeeze, unscrew the cap a little bit, and then you can go ahead and just like that, guys. Pretty simple. Yeah, I like it. So, anyway, anyway you guys, thanks for watching. 
Your boy Waffles is out. Remember to put some syrup on that. Have a good day, guys. Before I go, though, remember, I'm chugging that bowl of Gatorade later today. Yes, I'm chugging Gatorade in a bowl later today, guys. And we will have another Pokemon opening on Friday, so make sure to stay tuned. Bye, guys. Hopefully you have a good day. Hopefully this works for you.